Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, SciTechGuru. In this video, I will like show you what is the default graphics settings in the POCO F3 GT device by using the PUBG version which is 1.6.0. As you can see friends, finally I was able to install the PUBG version which is 1.6.0 and in this video, I will like show you exactly what is the default graphics you are getting with this PUBG version which is 1.6.0 and which lot of users are actually interested to know whether this time the mobile got updated with a 90 FPS or not. That's what my main focus will be there in this video and uh, let's see and I'll try to make another video as well how to install this latest APK I mean latest version so which is a 1.6.0 as well which you did see over there so let me try to start again to show you the exact APK so on the top you will be able to see the version number clearly what is going on and right now the 1.6.0 whatever I installed as you can see 1.6.0 version so let me to show you the default settings so i am really interested to see friends damage to 1200 in this phone got updated or not because the realme x and max has got the 90 fps update before itself i think one and a half month back or two months back but this phone let's see what about the poco x f3 gt whether this got 90 fps or not settings and uh, here we go with the graphics one two three no not it as you can see friends so what are the apk which i installed in the pubg 1.6 i cannot find any kind of indication with the 90 fps so far in this phone in the poco f3 gt device unfortunately that's a kind of uh, slightly kind of drawback i would say i'm not sure exactly friends so when we get the official update maybe but right now whatever the apk i installed with the 1.6 i was unable to get that 90 fps working at this moment so right now you'll be able to play only at the 60 fps in the poco f3 gt unfortunately but uh, don't worry i'll try to do the similar kind of testing in the other small other phones to test and right now i was able to get about fps of close to 60 fps only that's a pretty common thing so definitely friends i'll try to do the in-depth uh, gameplay test as well on the poco f3 gt using the pubg version which is 1.6 just to see how compatible it is with this uh, phone what is happening with the fps drop test and all those things i'll definitely do the testing so make sure to stay tuned for those videos in case if you're interested I'll ultimately do my testing as soon as possible. So right now I need to do one more thing. I need to test in all the phones, whatever I'm having. So in terms of supporting the PUBG version, whether the 1.6 will be supported in the other phones or not. Similarly like this. That's what I'm going to exactly demonstrate in the upcoming videos. videos. So stay tuned for those videos, friends, in case if you're interested. So first phone I thought of trying in the dimensity process and next I'll try to do in the Snapdragon 870 chipset as well. Even in those phones, I'll try to do the testing so very soon. So stay tuned for those videos. So let me do the quick drop test and then I'll try to end up this video and I'll, I don't want to keep very long and lengthy video friends so at this moment and right now we're getting FPS drop test of close to 57 and we got completely like new maps I think in uh, this is the APK which I installed you can see different F FPS dropped up to 57 50 57 and 50 the FPS drop, not bad. If you want you can set these triggers as well for this gameplay, that's another thing. In case if you want it, you can definitely do that. So that's it friends, thank you for watching this video. This is a quick review on the default graphic settings in the POCO F3 GT after the recent PUBG version 1.6.0 update. So thank you for watching and still we did not get the 90 fps i'm not sure when we'll be getting so see you in the next video i'll straight to more more videos and uh, meanwhile signing off bye